Today on Two Crazy Ketos, we're going to try some super fat products. Let's see if we go nuts for them right, right after, after this. this. Hey, what's up, family? I'm Rachel. And I'm Joe. And we are Two, two Crazy, Crazy Ketos. Ketos. If you're new to our channel, welcome. Here on Two Crazy Ketos, we do different things like recipe videos, we do product reviews, we talk about various keto topics, and then every Monday, we sit down on the couch for Keto on the Couch. We just kind of talk about what's going on in our lives for the week. You can find us in different social media platforms like Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter. And we have a website, which is twocrazyketos.com. That's where you're going to find all of our different recipes. Now, we do upload at least five new videos every single week, so make sure you subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to hit the little bell icon and that way every single time we upload a new video, you'll be alerted to it. Yeah. So today we're going to review some products from a company called Super Fat. And I'm really excited because I'm always looking for shelf stable stuff. Yeah. So they have a bunch of different products that they've sent us. We have, they sent us actually a variety box of nut butters. How fun is this? And so inside of these, this variety pack, there are actually five different types of nut butters. Wow. So let's see, we have up here, this is the protein one. It's just called protein. And then we have, what else? We have a macadamia MCT with probiotics. Wow. We this have one a macadamia is, coconut. This one's cacao coconut. Cacao coconut. And then, up oh, here's Rachel's coffee with MCTs. Okay, I just got happy. And these are all nut butters. And then in addition, they also have cookies. Cookies. And we have two different types of cookies. We have chocolate chip. Okay. And we have a snicker snickerdoodle. Doodle. So we're gonna try all of these different products. I don't know if we're gonna try all the different nut butters. We're gonna try one of each cookie. We'll try the, one of the nut butters. Well, what's nice about it is you can open it and then close, close it, it back again. Up. So I see you brought spoons. I guess that's to control ourselves, right? Well, just because I don't want like our mouths all over the top of this. I mean, okay. I Where are we gonna start? Better. Where are we going to start? Do you want to try all of the different nut butters? Is I do. that what you want to do? So do. which flavor do you want to start with? Well. I, I don't know if we need to start with, try both macadamia. Well, I guess one's macadamia coconut. Yeah. We'll try with that one first. Yeah. Okay. Now Got you are ready. probably supposed to like need, need these up. We need some. Because yeah, all of the nut butters. The oils separate. It's right. Because it's all good stuff. It's a sign of good things, right? That's right. These pouches remind me so much of toddlers, right? Because that's the <laughs> thing. pouches. You see the little pouches now of all their baby food? And this is actually probably a great thing to give kids. Okay, you ready? Yeah. So we'll start off with macadamia coconut. Oop. We'll put all that to the side. We're not going to do too much since we're going to try all of these different ones. Yeah. Well, that is good. That is delicious. That's macadamia coconut? That's macadamia coconut. Doesn't have a big coconut flavor. Maybe that, just a little touch. Macadamia is in the lead in that. Yeah, that is really good. That's that's really good. I got Next my up, coffee over here. You wanna just stick with the macadamia and do the macadamia MCT plus probiotics. So we'll see if there's a difference. I can't wait to see what the ingredients are on these guys. Yeah, I forgot my glasses, but I'm looking right here. This one is 27 grams of fat and the MCT one is 30 grams of fat. That so, makes sense though. Yeah. lighter in color so you think you're going to get a boost of clarity with this one <laughs> i don't know it definitely has a different color whoa way fattier it's definitely fattier definitely tastes a lot more fat it's got it's a little bit richer wow okay next up i want to save coffee for last you want to save coffee for last of course i want to finish with coffee protein this is protein. So on the front it says almond and macadamia nut butter. That's kind of funny. Just protein. Ooh. Well, that's a little bit thicker. Yeah. It's protein. There's a steak in there. Mmm. Oh, I think that's my favorite so far. That is delicious. That's my favorite so far. Wow, the almond really the gives almond some sweetness. The almond really comes through to it. 
Next up. Cacao, Cacao coconut. Cacao. Just trying to make sure it's well needed. Whenever you get any of these nut butters in these pouches, which is much better in the pouches than when they used to have them all in the jars. Yeah. In the jars, you try to stir them. I wish you can get the peanut butters and the almond but butters like in the store like we said, like it's better. Yeah. That's a good indicator that you have good ingredients. Yeah. But whenever you get them, just make sure you knead them really well. But I like them in the pouches better because you can knead them as opposed to trying to stick your spoon in a jar and stirring it and half the oil ends up all over your counter. Yep. Now, I'm expecting this to taste chocolatey. That's what I'm thinking. Hmm. It's more That's buttery. Good. Very buttery. It's not bad. The chocolate, there's a, a, a hint of a chocolate flavor. A hint, but not like what I was thinking it's it was. It's not overdoing be. it. I do taste the coconut. I do taste coconut. Okay, last one coffee. Coffee. Gotta cleanse my palate. In preparation for this one. Okay. I really hope they nail it. Stop pulling away. Got me scared. Now this one is thicker. Whoa, that's like bitter, but not like in a good way, in a fun way, if you're a coffee person. That's a bitter coffee. Mm-hmm. It reminds me of wow. nips. Do you mm -hmm. remember the coffee nips candy? That's the coffee flavor that it has. I weirdly love that one. I actually really like that too. It's I got really a like very interesting taste. Nothing I've ever tasted before. Yeah. We're going to rank them when we get to the five things review. But if you don't like bitter black coffee, you're probably not going to like, like that. You won't like that flavor. Okay, let's try the cookies. Okay, we got, I want to end in chocolate chip. Go with snickerdoodles. Snickerdoodles are always okay in my mind, but not awesome. I always would prefer a chocolate chip cookie. So, ooh, these look like a high key cookie. Okay. They're like more You want a crunchy. whole cookie or a half a cookie? So that's what they look like. Whole cookie, they're little. Okay, ready? Uh -huh. Crunchy. Not as hard as high key, but they've got a nice butteriness to them. And it's a snickerdoodle, that's for sure. It mm -hmm. definitely has a good snickerdoodle taste. Mm -hmm. Usually you can always judge the old snickerdoodle, like did it have that granular cinnamon like sugar feel? Like you wanted to feel that granular texture in a snickerdoodle. It has a granular texture. Yeah, it definitely does. That's what I'm saying, it's good. But. I don't know, it's it's still moist. It's very moist. Yeah. Okay. Ooh, these got crushed a little bit. Aw. Chocolate chip. <laughs> oh, poor thing. Yeah, this this is kind of like at this point. This bag got cr crushed. It gets so, smushy. Like, I don't have another whole cookie in here. It's, it's kind of crumbs. Yeah. Now. Okay. Ready? Mm-hmm. Mmm. The chocolate in that's good. They're not bad. There's I a little bit the of snickerdoodle. There's a little bit of a cooling effect. A little bit. It's hard for me to tell again because I basically at this point have cookie crumbs left in here. They just kind of that will go on top of ice cream. Ice cream. Okay. Uh, you want to put this through five things? Five things. Five things. So if you're new to our channel, we review all products based on five things. We're going to talk about the ingredients. Does it keto based on a nutrition label? How does it taste? How much does it cost? And finally, would we recommend it? So number one. Where are we going to start? Ingredients. Let's I got my kinda, glasses over here. Let's kind of look at the back of. Um, I got the box. I was going to say. It'll you be might... easier. I have the box. So yeah. the ingredients on, we'll go with coffee. Yeah. Coffee is almonds, macadamia nuts, MCT oil powder, freeze-dried coffee, erythritol, cinnamon, pink Himalayan salt, and stevia. Okay. Cacao coconut, coconut cacao. butter, almonds, erythritol, cacao powder, macadamia nuts, cinnamon, pink Himalayan salt, stevia. Macadamia coconut is macadamia nuts, almonds, coconut butter, and pink Himalayan salt. Okay. The MCT macadamia is macadamia nuts, MCT oil powder, Cinnamon, pink Himalayan salt, Bacillus coagulus, GPI number 30, which is a, pre a probiotic. 
Then you have the protein is almonds, macadamia nuts, sunflower protein powder, erythritol, cinnamon, pink Himalayan salt, and stevia. So the ingredients are all really, really good, good ingredients. ingredients. Really good ingredients. Yeah. So uh, that's those. Cookie-wise, I got the chocolate chips. And I got snickerdoodle. Does say right on the back, we don't use fillers or palm oil. The ingredients are almond, erythritol, butter, chocolate chips, uh, almond flour, coconut flour, coconut oil, water, arrowroot flour, eggs, acacia gum, collagen, baking soda, vanilla extract, psyllium husk powder, stevia, and salt. Same ingredients here without, gonna have cinnamon the, too. without the chocolate too. I would assume it has cinnamon, right? Yes, it does. It yeah. has cinnamon. <laughs> I would hope so. It's snickered. Snickered it all. So... Ingredients on all of this is really, really good. Very, very good. Number two, does the keto based on a nutrition label? Well, let's start here with the cookies. cookies. Now, I kind of love that it's four cookies in a serving. Yep. Which is pretty nice. Yeah, and they're pretty decent size. Yeah. And uh, 150 calories per serving, 13 grams of fat, 4 grams of protein, 12 total carbohydrates, 3 dietary fiber, which I like because they're not playing the fiber game. Right. Um, And then it's got 6 sugar alcohols. So that's uh, 3 net carbs per serving, 2 servings in the pouch. So 6 net carbs if you were to eat Eat the whole bag. the whole bag. Yeah. That would be a lot of cookies. Yeah. But that's nice. Yeah. Very, very good. Good. Okay. So... Coming back to the nut butters, they're all close. Coffee is 240 calories, cacao coconut 240 calories, macadamia is 270 calories, you'd expect that. Macadamia MCT is 300 calories, the protein is 240 calories. And they're saying that this is a serving, this one pouch. Yes, no, there's two servings in a container. Two servings per container, it says serving size is a pouch, 42 42 grams, grams. so that is this. Okay, so this is a serving, it's kind of weird that, oh, there's two servings in this box. Yeah, two of each flavor. In this box, yes, that's my fault. So that's very, that's really nice. That's a nice serving. That is a huge amount. So, okay, fat, coffee is 20 grams, the cacao coconut is 22, macadamia 27, you'd expect that, macadamia MCT is 31, protein is 21. Um, You have eight grams of protein in the coffee MCT, five in the cacao coconut, six in the macadamia coconut, three grams of protein in the macadamia MCT probiotics, and then nine grams in the protein one, which okay. it's called protein, so I would hope. For a, for a reason. Okay, now here we go, carbs. Uh, coffee MCT, 11 total carbs, five grams of dietary fiber, one gram of sugar alcohol, so that's gonna make it five net carbs, 11 total carbs for the coffee MCT. Okay. Cacao coconut, 12 total carbs, six dietary fiber, three sugar alcohol, so that's gonna make that three net carbs. Uh, macadamia coconut, eight total carbs. Wow. Five dietary fiber, so it's three net carbs, but it's eight total carbs. I love that. Eight total Me carbs too. in a macadamia. Macadamia MCT probiotics, seven total carbohydrates, four grams of dietary fiber, making it three net carbs. There's no sugar alcohols in, in those. Amazing. And then the protein one, 10 total carbs, five dietary fiber, one sugar alcohol, making it four net carbs. Wow. So nutrition wise, keto wise, uh, obviously, as you would expect, the macadamia ones are going to be the best ones because there's no almonds in them, and it's just going to, you know, lower down those total carbs. Actually, I think one of them did have almonds, right? But yeah. none of them were bad. Yeah, none of them are super bad. No. I would just lean towards the macadamia more for the lower total carbs. Yeah. Number three, how do they taste? I'll let you do this. Okay, so first, let's deal with the cookies. The cookies are pretty good. Maybe not my favorite cookie that mm-hmm. I've ever had, but they are nice and crunchy, mm-hmm. and they taste like chocolate chips and snickerdoodles. Yeah. What did you think? Um, to me, the cookies are okay. They're 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 not bad. They're definitely on the upper level of keto cookies that I've had. I'm a little disappointed that they came crumbled up for me, mm-hmm. um, but taste wise, they're really good. Uh, a slight cooling effect for me. And that's something but I'm super sensitive to. Some people are more sensitive than others. Yeah. So that's just something to, to take in effect. But I do like the taste of them, especially compared to a lot of other brands. Yeah. Okay. So, but once we move the cookies out of the way and we get into what I was really the most excited about, I'm very, very pleasantly surprised with both the variety 
of these guys and how good they taste. Yeah. So if you had to line them up as far as like your your favorite taste to least favorite taste, I almost have to go with that protein one that had the, what was it, the almonds. If I'm going by taste, favorite taste is the protein one. Same. That was my favorite taste. I think that's the wrong one. We're looking. Oh, this is macadamia coconut. It's this one okay so that's the that's my favorite to, that to me the best tasting one Same in my for me. opinion the next up for me would be the coffee mct because it's very like different tasting. it's very different i would Bitter. probably i would probably buy this one over the protein one because it's personally, nothing because I it's haven't very tasted. different um and then both of these macadamia ones are kind of like up there as far as taste i'm gonna put this one dead last yeah i was not like really pleased with the taste of the cacao one. I finally got it to stand up. It's standing up now. There we go. It's like those action figures that like they have flat feet, but they don't quite. Stand well, when up. I was a kid, we had the army men, but none of the army men actually stood no. up. We had the reject army men. I always would try to get the ones that were just laying down already. <laughs> Let me be the guy that's just laying down already. Okay, yeah. So I honestly, if I'm if I'm buying them, I'm buying the coffee one first. I like the taste of the protein one. This is sweeter. But it's very similar to any of the nut butters I'm going to buy in the store. That coffee one is incredible tasting. But I'm telling you right now, it is. You got to like coffee. You've got to like coffee, and you've got to like kind of like that bitter taste. Yeah, like we used to eat coffee beans, like chocolate covered coffee beans. If you don't like that taste, you're really not going to. You're not like going to like that one. So. So number four, how much do they cost? I've got the computer here. We're gonna go down them. So the cookies, $15 for three bags. Okay, so three bags. So it's $5 a bag. $5 a bag, and then there's two, two servings, servings in a bag. Serving. So $2.50 so it's actually not bad at all. is right in there with most desserts. Yep. Now the nut butters, they have a lot of different options. One of the options is a large bag, a large pouch, which is six servings. Do and, not buy that. And that's $12.99, so it would be basically six of these. I would not I would not buy that. Buy that. <laughs> Cause I will eat it. It is delicious. I'm sure it's a lot cheaper to buy it that way. If you're just looking at six servings, so that's gonna be what, twelve ninety nine, so that's gonna be a little over two dollars, like two dollars and ten cents, two dollars and twenty cents per serving. Um, Who has an iron will out there? Yeah. If you've got a steel trap willpower, go for it. Then they have... Not me. <laughs> okay, so they have the variety box, which is what we have here. Yeah. The variety box is $38 for 10. So that's $3.80 a serving. Honestly, that is where I would start to right. make sure what is my favorite flavor. Right. Then you have after that, there is the macadamia with the MCT and the probiotics. That is $40 for 10 of them. So it's $4 a pouch. Oh, okay. Uh, all of the other ones are $35 for 10. So $3.50. So the macadamia with the MCT is 50 cents more per little pouch. I'll tell you something I would do, and I know you're gonna be like, I would not waste it like that. You could take the MCT oil one, I would squirt it right into a blender with my coffee and make a really delicious coffee. Right. So just again, looking at the super fat macadamia coconut butter does come, and that one and the cacao coconut, so not the coffee one. Those are the ones that come in the multi-serving bags. And it is significantly cheaper at like $2 a serving but you're gonna have to have some good willpower to open up a pouch with six servings and not eat six servings. If you wanna go a step further in awesomeness, can I make a suggestion? Take this and squirt it into two molds and put it in your freezer because yeah. these things like freeze up so, so it's, tasty. It's like, yeah, it's like peanut butter candy, good it, job. It's really good. Okay, now they also did give us a coupon code. I'll leave a link down below. The coupon code is 2 Crazy Ketos, and it will get you 15% off if you wanna buy it. They also have some different deals for getting free shipping. They have some different bundles. I'm gonna, I'll leave a link to the website. That's the best thing because there's a lot of different bundles of like cookie bundles, cookie and you know nut butter bundles where you can save money bundling it up and stuff like that. Bundle up this winter. Bundle it up. Number five, would we recommend this? I would absolutely recommend all of the products, but the nut butters in particular. This is get definitely going to be a taste by taste basis. People like different cookies for different reasons. Yeah. But these guys are rock stars. I absolutely recommend the nut butters. The cookies to me are average. They're okay. They're not horrible tasting no. by any means, but I'm going with the nut butters, especially the 
the coffee one. Yeah. Uh, that coffee so is just different, different for me. Very different. Yeah. I just, I, I'm, I'm excited about it. Yeah. Well, that is our video for today. Let us know down in the comment section which one of these flavors you would want to try. Please do us a favor, hit that like button down below. And don't forget to subscribe to our channel and hit the little bell icon and that way every single time we upload a new video, you'll be alerted to it. Until next time. Bye. bye.